Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be the third update for my Rolling Lippies project pan. This is a project that I started March this year and I will keep doing this as long as I do have lip products to pan. My goal is really to have a lip product collection where I really had staple products that I truly truly love. I think I mentioned 20 lipsticks and 5 lip glosses to be my goals in my makeup inventory video that I uploaded in January and I think that sounds reasonable. Currently I do have more and yeah, I just want to pan some lip products. I'm sick of having so much and lip products certainly are makeup products that expire sooner than for example powder products. So I really want to do some panning and I do have at once four lip products in this project. If I finish a lip product I will roll in a new lip product as the name of the project tells and I do monthly updates. I will try to upload around 10th of each month. So let's get into the update number three. Okay, so I do have one empty and if you watched my May empties you notice already but I finished my Essence Color and Care lipstick in the say Girls Club and I'm so proud of myself. This is the first ever colorful lipstick that I finished and it is a pink lipstick and pink is not really my favorite lip color so I'm really excited that this one is now gone. Now obviously it is a smaller lip product, it wasn't the hardest. The formula was also more creamy, kind of like satiny finish and something that needs to be reapplied during the day so it wasn't a hard product to pan but I must say that I was getting a little bit sick of the color. I am just not somebody who wants to wear a pink lipstick every single day so I'm really excited that this one is now gone and I'm going to roll in a new lipstick in the end of this video. But first let's check out the progress with the three other lip products in this project. So the last product that I do have now left since the intro is this Pacifica Color Quench Lip Tint and I do have this one in the shade Vanilla Hispiscus and it is actually what I am wearing today. So this is a tinted lip balm. It really doesn't have even a color to it. It's just like a really sheer tint that it does have to it. This one is something that I have been waiting and in the last update this weighted 8 grams and my goal was to get this one down to 7 grams. Unfortunately I wasn't able to do it so this still weighs 8 gram and actually I don't know how I realized right now that I can roll this one up but I can. Previously when I have tried to roll this one up and when I have tried to roll it down it didn't come down but now it works so I don't know if it was something wrong with the packaging or what but I was able to roll it up. I'm not going to do any progress line marking anymore but that is how much I have left and it is a little bit more what I kind of wished for. I hoped that there would be so little bit of product that I could use it up before the next update but I actually don't think I will be able to. Now this is something that I will wear a lot to work, especially on early mornings when I don't have that much time to do my makeup and I just want to wear something really natural. This is also what I was wearing in my pro routine video and in that video I had like really typical natural makeup day makeup. I'm trying to get as much use out of this one during the next month that I can but I don't think I will be able to finish this but I really want to finish this product within the next two months so this is kind of like the main lip product that I'm focusing on right now. It's nice because it goes with different things but then again it's not really my favorite thing to wear if I do have on a bolder makeup Today I think it goes beautifully with my makeup because I do have this pink eyeshadow situation going on. I'm doing my best with it. Hopefully I can finish it 
during the next couple of months. Then I actually had two empties in my last update and I was able to roll in two new lip products to this project. So I rolled in this The Balm Read My Lips lip gloss in the shade Snap and this one is like a beige creamy nude and I think it is a really beautiful lip gloss. I have been wearing it surprisingly much. I didn't think I would wear it that much, but I think this goes with many different looks. It's not maybe my first pick to all of the looks, but it works. Surprisingly enough, I was able to go down in the weight of this product. So last update this weighed at 16 grams and now it weighs 15 grams, which is exciting. Then I rolled in another The Balm lip product in the last update, so The Balm with Matthews liquid lipstick in the set Charming. This is probably my favorite liquid lipstick in my collection because it is such a beautiful color. I haven't been wearing this that much in the past month, but I have been wearing it at least a couple of times. And if I didn't roll this into this project, in the last update I would have worn this a zero times, which is unfortunate, but it is true. And the reason I did roll this into this project is that this is my oldest liquid lipstick. It is four years in the fall and yeah, I just think for this kind of product that's a long age and I really want to use this up before it expires. But this one unfortunately didn't go down in the weight, I really wasn't expecting it. So this weighed at 16 grams in the last update and it weighed at 16 grams today. But maybe it will weigh less in the next update. I don't know. It's not something I'm really focusing on right now during summer. But if I can wear it even a couple of times during a month, it's better than nothing. And this is something that I'm really going to focus on finishing it during fall. Okay, so because I finished the Essence Color and Care lipstick, I am going to roll in a new lip product. Now, I have been thinking that I, in future, I want to have in this project one lipstick, one lip gloss, one liquid lipstick, and then either one lip liner or one lip care product or something else. But because I did finish a ballet lipstick, I wanted to roll in a new ballet lipstick and I decided to go with this Jelly Pong Pong Lip Butter in the set Balloons. This is something that I got from a subscription service a couple of years ago, maybe in 2016. And it is a beautiful nude lipstick. I actually don't have that much of product left here because this is something that I have been using quite a lot. I did mark some progress lines but it doesn't make any sense for me to show it to you right now because obviously it is where I'm starting with this product today. But the reason I wrote this in is that I want to finish this one. It is not vegan product and I am trying to pan my non-vegan products. I also think that this is a beautiful color during summer. It is this light peachy nude. I think it goes beautifully with colorful looks for example or with warmer toned looks. So it is perfect during summer. I don't think it will take that long for me to finish this. Now without seeing how much progress I can make with this product in one month, I I don't have yet any goals of how soon I would like to finish this, like in how many months, but at least before winter I would like this one to be gone and I think I can do it because there is not that much product left and also because this formula needs to be reapplied during the day. It's not something that is going to last on my lips the whole day. I will need to reapply in every couple of hours. But it is a pretty shade and I think it's beautiful for the summer. So the two lip products that I will be really focusing on right now are this Pacifica Lip Tint and also this Jelly Pong Pong Lip Butter. Also I do have some lip products in my Throwback 30 project pan, but with those lip products my goal is just to get some use out of them and make some progress with them, but I don't think I can finish all of them up. But these I'm really trying to finish. 
But yeah, that was everything for today. I am pretty sure there won't be any empties by the next update, but I hope I can get some crude progress on the Pacifica lip tint and the Jelly Pong Pong lip butter. So thank you so much for watching this video and see you in my next one. Bye bye.